Hi, I'm Teresa Callahan, and I have spent the past month in a few powerful conversations with therapist Janet Mazalewski. We've been talking about anxiety in the workplace and stress in the workplace. And it really didn't even occur to me until today in a study group with some of my clients talking about this topic with her, that maybe we as leaders cause some of the stress and anxiety that we experience in the workplace. Um, you know, this is a relationship system at work. And many of us don't learn this stuff uh, as we become business owners and team leaders within our organization. Um, dealing with a complex system of people is challenging a lot of the time. And in a high productive business, you're going to have anxiety. Uh, and sometimes people are going to feel stress because we're striving to produce results, right? It isn't such a bad thing, but how we react to it is really critical. Uh, becoming aware that there's an emotional system in the workplace, especially when you have a small grouping group of people that you're working together every day, is important. Um, and what your own reactive behaviors are to situations absolutely governs the success or the failure of a team breaking through those high-powered, high-energy periods of stress and anxiety when you've got deadlines looming and challenges to conquer and results to create. Um, leading from a place of grace and being able to acknowledge that the anxiety and the stress might be present is really the first step. Um, recovering from negative things when they go wrong is absolutely the number one key in being a resilient leader. Things don't always go our way. So I wanna thank Janet for her conversations. I want this to be a reminder to all of us that we need to be resilient leaders and take ownership of the role that we play and the influence that we have on everyone around us. If anybody gets one message out of this like I have, <laughs> it'll be helpful. Um, so on becoming a resilient leader, and uh, here's to some great successes. It takes a lot of courage, and we can't do it alone. So I appreciate the opportunity to share this message with all of you. Have a great day.